Greetings, YouTube. This is Mr. Chrono666, and I am here by verting a Game Boy. Right now, I just recently installed the chip. Look at that pretty little chip. Let's zoom in. You know, not the best solderer, but I did much better that time. Now the wires are touching. Looking pretty decent. And then here, I soldered the wires to all the points of the Game Boy. No real issues. Again, I'm still learning how to solder these little fine-tuned parts but I did okay and everything is in place and I'm actually having some issues because it appears um, this here is inverted I have yet to change off the screen it's still that ugly original Game Boy screen we all grew up with so I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna turn on the power we're gonna see how it looks Let's see if I can one hand it yeah and it's flickering for some reason Try to make that contrast very clear that's decent right there, I guess. So, yeah, we can actually see that the bivert was a success. No, well, invert. And it looks good, aside from the flickering. So I'm trying to figure out why it is flickering. It's not as vibrant on the camera. There we go, you can kind of see it right there. So does anybody know why? Why, why, why? I'm asking all my sources. There we go, you can actually see it get kind of a wavy pattern there but it's not as bad I gotta resolder the, the screen a bit there we go good old Japanese Pokemon like I said it looks good but unfortunately it's flickering I don't like it I've tried it on two um, PCBs and I've gotten the same result maybe I used the wrong term whatever this screen thing here I've used two two separate ones I've got my crappy test one over there see this is damaged beautiful I used that one and I had the same flickery problem, but it was biverted. I think I burned out the chip the first time, but this time here, the chip was not burnt out. I made sure not to solder the hell out of it like a dum dum. So, yeah. Anybody know what the hell I did wrong? Please let me know. Yeah, that's about it. I'll go ahead and add a sweet picture of the last Game Boy I just did. It's pretty cool. Alright, later. All right, here's a quick little video to add to the other one. This is the uh, actual Bivert chip. Boom, it's, actually, it's hooked up to a screen that I've already modified. This is my damaged one. Eh, damaged. So yeah, as we see here, it's flickering. Um, it's a little more prominent on my end because you can't see it off the camera, but that there is not, you know, some sort of video recording magic where it just has that flickeriness. Let's go ahead and actually go into the game. If I get the thingy hooked up right. There we go. There we go. So yeah, as we see, it looks beautiful. The only part that sucks is the flickering. Stabilize the camera. Let's go ahead and turn it all, all dark. Yeah, you can't really see it that way. Ease into it, maybe still really hard to see. Promise you though it's there. So yeah. Cheers. 